guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Primrose and today what we're going to be doing is a very, very different video to what I usually do. So I'm doing a room makeover video. Now, I've been planning on making over my room for the longest time, at least since I've got back, so a good few months. And I've been planning it for ages, but because I've not had any money to do it, I'm just a bit like, I've been putting it off and putting it off, put it off and putting it off. So, the other day, I was, well, the other day, yesterday. <laughs> so yesterday, I was cleaning my room, and I was hoovering behind all the things that I didn't usually hoover behind. I was super paranoid about spiders, and I took out, because I've got a section next to my wardrobe where I keep, like, stuffed toys and stuff that are kind of cute that I've had for ages, and the back of the wardrobe is going mouldy, and I was completely disgusted. Like, I am not a dirty person, but this house that I live in, my family home, is super, super old, and has really really bad ventilation so the fact that it couldn't get any air behind it caused it to obviously get moist from having the heating on over winter and it just went moldy and it's so disgusting I cannot get over how disgusting it is and I could not stay in this room with it like that so this is the incentive I need to make over this bloody room honestly I have a similar desk as well under my TV where I have my PlayStation and other clothes in the drawers I pulled that forward and that is also going the same so I was like ah! I can't believe this. So, it's super gross. Plan for this video is I am going to do a room makeover on zero pounds, essentially, kind of. So it's gonna be on a complete tight, tight, tight budget because I have no money right now. I've already cleared out the wardrobe that was going really moldy. We just got that out straight away last night. But, but the one that I've got with my PlayStation on, that's kind of the only thing that's resting it on there. I wanna empty that of all the clothes, make sure they're not going funny either. And then I'm gonna sort out between things I wanna sell, things I wanna donate, and then things I wanna keep. Once that is done, the plan is to paint my room completely white. So as you can see behind me, I've got a couple of feature walls that have this wallpaper on. That's going, that's gonna be completely white because I want it to look airy. There is a light problem in this room as in it doesn't let much in and bulbs don't really brighten up the room very much so I want it to look bright, airy, spacious, a little bit boho-y. That's the plan. Now I'm going to show you the situation which is my room right now and you can't judge me because I've emptied my wardrobe and there's clothes everywhere. So I'll do a little like before and after but yeah I can't wait to get started and not the best timing because I don't have no money but we'll try and do this on a budget. Okay, so as you can see, there's a lot of clothes, clutter and stuff that needs to be sorted out. So the first job is to, I think, take out all of the stuff from the cupboards that are currently still moldy in here and see if any of those are going funny. In terms of all the clothes on my bed, that's kind of the stuff that was in my wardrobe and it's all stuff that I was wearing on a regular basis, but I am gonna go through it again and just clear out anything that I don't really want. So they're gonna be removed and whittled down. That is phase one of the clearing out process. <laughs> lunch and cleaned all of the space behind me so as you can see all my shelves are cleared and what I've decided to do next is paint the room in sections just because if I clear everything out there's going to be no room in the hallway. I'm going to be painting this section of my room first and then I'm going to work my way around. What I'm going to do right now is get ready to paint so I'm going to change out these clothes and my mum did so lovely buy me some matte emulsion for my walls so I haven't had to pay anything there and she also got the dust sheets that we're going to put on the floor so not cost me anything so far thank you mum for that because it's just such a lifesaver okay <laughs> oh and I'm also going to take the shelves off because I'm not sure if I want to keep those long term because they've been screwed onto the wall I might have to hang some art there or something but I'm not 100% sure yet it's all very sudden so I'm like I've got all these ideas going around in my head um but yeah I'm gonna stop rambling and go get changed So 
So this is one of the first designs I did when Instagram first came out and I uploaded this on my personal account. I'll put like here how long ago that actually was. So that's how old this is and I haven't repainted it since so it is definitely in some need of love and TLC because I hate this design now. It's so bad but at the time I thought it was the best thing in the world and I even did like little daisies on here as well. I know. <laughs> so I'm going to dust this down and repaint it but first I have to remove the other one. It was really hard, it was really hard to get off. I don't do stuff like this at all, so this is an achievement. <laughs> So we have just finished our second coat and we think it might need another one after this um, but we're pretty much going to be finished for today because it takes two to four hours to dry so this is what it looks like looking pretty good so far but i think it could definitely do with maybe just one more especially on the patterned wallpaper um so we're going to see how that looks tomorrow in the meantime i think i'm going to clear out my desk space just here um, so that's all ready to go for tomorrow as well. Potentially clear out the space underneath my TV, um, but I'm not too sure about that yet. It depends if I've got space to put all the stuff that I need to move. <laughs> so um, if I don't end up doing that, then I will see you guys tomorrow. Okay, so we have completely cleared out, well, my desk has completely gone. Um, under my TV, that's all completely gone as well. So we've got that nice, fresh space to start on tomorrow. Um, and then potentially tackle this side of the room at the same time. Um, but I'm completely done for today. I've spent all day doing this, so um, I need a break. I need to go get some food. So yeah, thank you so much for watching so far. I will see you again tomorrow. Bye. Good morning. It is day two of the room makeover. So we're just gonna get crack straight on with painting. Um, hopefully we're gonna get the rest of the room done today, um, but we will see how that goes and to see how far we actually get. The wall behind me actually looks pretty good so far. Um, we're gonna give it one more coat though, just to make sure that it is definitely definitely covered and then it should be done.
Was denn das? You got the spider touch. Good morning, so we are on day number three of painting and hopefully this is our very last day. We have just got a few things to touch up on the wall that's been painted three times. We have to paint this wall just one more time and then the rest of the room twice. So hopefully we're gonna smash this out today, get the room completely finished and then we can begin decorating. guys so I'm finally at the point where I can start decorating my room which is crazy the last time I spoke to you guys I had just about finished painting I think and since then it's kind of turned into a not so much a budget because my mum insisted that she buys me new curtains and a new bed so I have now got a double bed within my room <laughs> um, but everything else I have funded myself so all of the um, the duvet I bought myself, that was from House of Fraser and it is in this gorgeous pink blush colour. I just absolutely love it. Um, and then I'm planning on doing a DIY blanket for my bed just so it ties in a bit. I want it to be white so it ties in all of the white. Um, I do want to possibly look for some more throw pillows because the two that I've put on there at the moment are just old ones that I've had for a long time. So what happens now is um, I basically set up my TV and my PlayStation. However, I need to start filling the shelves and my rail that I have in here and see what space that I actually have once I have all the things in here that I want. Um, this is super exciting. This is like my favorite bit. And then I can, I wanna look for some art for my walls. It's super, super exciting. Thank you. 